Hey, what's going on YouTube? I'm a story twelve here, and today I'm gonna be uh, testing out my new microphone that I just bought, and also showing you uh, install it. So if you don't know what that is, that is how you get free paid apps when you jailbreak your iPod. So first, I'm gonna show you how to get it. So obviously, you go into Cydia. You're gonna go to Manage at the very bottom. You're gonna go to Sources. And you're gonna click on Edit and Add. And you're gonna add a source called uh, Cydia. Not Cydia. <laughs> Acidia dot hack ulo uh, dot us. So once you add that source, you'll get this little thing right here, hack ulo, and you can install uh, install us from there. So you just, of course, go to add. Mine says modify because I already have it. But once you install that, you'll install an app, as you can see right there. Install us. And when you open that up, here's the app. So first, you can browse for games. It's very nice, and especially because they have apps from uh, other countries. So I say you live in the United States, you can get apps from anywhere, like China or whatever. Next, you can uh, search for apps. And if my thing hurries up, I'll be able to show you that. There you go. So you can uh, search for apps, any app ever, <laughs> any app ever. But yeah, you can search for apps there. Next is updates. This is relatively new, but if you download a cracked app and there's an update for it, it'll show you right here. Uh, the next is downloads, and this is where if you download an app, it will download, which I'll show you right now. Next is settings. You will always want to keep these two on: install automatically and delete automatically. That means it'll install the app that you just downloaded and it'll delete it from your, uh, I guess, from your folder. And the third one is iTunes Sync. I don't like this one, but you can uh, do it. And what this will do is, if you ever have your iPod connected to your computer, and uh, iTunes will actually read those apps and put it in your apps, so it'll look like you actually bought it. Now you can't like unjailbreak it and keep those apps, but I don't know, it just looks nicer, I guess. And you can also get a username and password from the website, right there, hackulo.us, the website. So that's really nice. Now I'm going to show you uh, how to download apps. So I'm just going to search uh, Tilt to Live. And as you can see, it's the first one. So right here, they'll give you exactly what you see in the real app store. All the information and uh, pictures. But what you need to do is click on download. And they'll give you all these download links for the updated, for the newest version, which would be the first one, and all the other versions that they have on file. So you normally want to get the most updated version. I do recommend Mediafire, but you can use any of these. I'm just gonna uh, use Mediafire. All right, so Mediafire is loading up. Click Start to download, and it's started. So as you can see, it's downloading right here. It'll, it'll tell you how long it roughly takes. So this one's gonna take about. A uh, minute and thirty. Actually, my bad. I thought you uh, how long left you have for it to download. So mine's pretty quick. As you can see, I'm running at about 117 gigabytes. So that's relatively fast for an iPod. And that is about it. Once it's finished downloading, uh, let me exit out this. Once it's finished downloading, it'll be on here. So all these apps that I have in my iPod right now, these five that I have, I all got from uh, Installs. And you know it's very nice. I mean, you gain them for free. That's a, what I have right here is probably like ten dollars already, and I got it for free. It might be illegal a little bit, but it's all educational. Anyways, it's been almost worth twelve, and thanks for watching.